you want to start off at this shrine right here at the bamboo grove snake trail once you get here you're gonna run up the stairs follow the path that i take it's those weird snake guys like i like to charge my attack and run Don't be shy to freeze them. Do whatever it is you want. Treat them like a boss. They can do a little bit of damage. And as you can see, you get 175 XP or whatever you want to call. Then run back to the bridge. Then jump off the bridge. Then there'll be one right here. Charge him up if you want. I used my transformation, honestly. Because the idea is you just want to plow through them. Plus this guy when you transform me at his own health bar, right? Now from here, if you get disoriented when you're under the bridge, it's really simple. You don't want to go up. You actually want to go down the path where it literally brings you down. And you want to find another of those snake men. As soon as you run down, you'll see them. Because there's these skeleton dudes that don't give much. They give like 30. But if you like look around over there, you can see he's got it. He's got the snake head. And then again, you freeze him. He'll take a bit of damage. It's really not a big deal. You can almost... You can almost ignore them. That's okay. I'm just doing this because... Because I can. I mean, if they're in your face... You might as well get them. But if you look, I'm like level 20 or whatever, and I'm already gaining a level every other time I do this run. Once you've come down here and you've taken out like the two main snake guys and then the two back there, there's about four in total. I'm not too good at math. Then what you can do from here is just use your incense trail talisman and it will automatically teleport you back to the last place that you went. I don't know how I got this item. Otherwise, you can just kind of like run back, but that's going to make you waste a lot of time. And then when you come here, you'll notice that it's, it's showtime. Like I don't even have to touch the shrine. So if I go to my inventory, uh, you should potentially have this incense trail talisman and then equip it in one of these uh, slots here. I do this one here so that when I push the or pull the R2 button and tap left on the d-pad it does it i had figured this out on my own but i watched another guy do it just to make sure that i wasn't crazy that this was actually good farming but he took like two goddamn minutes to get to the point and i'm like bitch you're so fucking slow how does this guy have a million subscribers i'm just saying i'm going back down over here again Kind of show you the routine, and as you could tell, I had just leveled up. You could see where I'm at now with the 175. And make sure you run down the path that literally has you running down. There's already a guy over there. I'm assuming it's a guy. I know nowadays you're not really supposed to do that, but whatever. Whoops, I don't have the mana. Like I said, you can... You can ignore them. But at the same time, it takes two seconds to take them out. But notice how you only get 30 again. And then once you're down here, just kind of like run in a circle. 
until you find the oh jeez that kind of caught me off guard <laughs> There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Jesus. And if you look at my XP bar, I'm already practically halfway to another level again. So to me, it's hard to argue that this isn't a good method to get some early XP, to get some early extra skill points in your tree to maybe help you with a boss. I know that there's been times where just getting an extra level or two, or maybe I just got a little bit better, uh, helped me defeat a boss. Thumbs up. As always, if you like the video, it does greatly help support the channel with the algorithm in trying to make me more relevant in the search results when people are looking shit up online. And if you didn't like it, go ahead, give it a thumbs down. I'll bend it in half, twist it, and I'll break it off inside your rectum with this thing here. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, naturally, that'd be great. But if not, thanks for stopping by anyways. Take care. Maybe if I'm lucky, I'll see some of you in the next one. Bye for now.